Okay, so we have to talk about my Narwax party. The plan was to videotape like the demos as they were happening, but turns out you don't need more than five people to have a good time. <laughs> I had some wine. I legitimately can't stop thinking about this stuff though. Like, I, it's all, it's, I just want to clean. I just want to clean everything and get rid of germs. My sister-in-law that hosted this party is a nurse. A nurse. She doesn't need money. She makes money. Yeah. I also trust her to know what the heck she's talking about because she's a nurse. A nurse. So she hands out the cloths, which I was already familiar with because I have the two of them. But one of them she wet down. I never wet mine down. And then she cracked an egg on my drawing surface. Like my wooden, wooden drawing board. So I was like, are you serious right now? That's like salmonella everywhere. Like, I, everyone knows that a raw egg is full of salmonella and con contamination. So we already knew it was contaminated, and then she sprinkled some powder on it to show us how contaminated it is, and points on it with a black light. Then she took out a disinfectant wipe, my favorite Myers yummy smelling spray, and her Norwalk's cloth. She used each one in different places, and then she put the black light back on. I was like, oh my god, my Myers stuff doesn't clean shit! In fact, the disinfectant cloth didn't do as well as the Norwex cloth either. And then she used the Norwex cloth to clean off the whole thing and shined it with the black light to show it's clean! Clean! Then she took it a step further. She took out these, like, science kits and swabbed everything. My favorite part, though, was when she swabbed the cloth and showed that the germs that she picked up didn't leave. The salmonella didn't leave the cloth. Which means when I clean up poop, it doesn't move. And when I clean up pee, it doesn't move. And when I clean up boogers, it doesn't move and they don't spread. I'm still not convinced that having to clean up that much fecal matter is normal, but I've seen other videos of moms losing their stuff and I guess it's normal. Which, speaking of the kids, um, they have a kid's line, and they have little dusting mitts that fit little hands. So my friend Renee looks at me and she's like, yeah, you should get one for Liam and get another one for a friend, and then they could have competitions of who can make their glove the dirtiest. Genius! Now my husband is making fun of me for making funny videos on Snapchat about my Norwex. Deep.